So what are you doing? So you got a just a little simple mount for the to dip the cars in the paint. Mm-hmm. And uh and then you can set them up to dry after. Oh, that's clever. So those are just um paint, paint stirrers. Yeah. And you just screwed a really long screw. Yep. That's it. You drill a little pilot hole in the bottom. Uh, these are just test pieces, but it's in the bottom um, to put the screw in. Because if you put the screw straight in, it might split the wood. Okay. And this will be covered up by the, the weights and all that. It's, you could also, I guess, fill in with like some wood filler or something afterwards if you needed to. Sounds good. So we'll do this and then we'll do the painting or we have to do something else? Um, we just have to sand it a little more maybe. But yeah, I think that's about it. Okay. So today we are going to paint the Pinewood Derby cars. Um, we have a few more days until the race. So we have to paint them, let them dry, add the weights, add the wheels, and make sure everything is to the right specifications. We're going to try this new technique to paint them called Hydro Dip. And I don't know how to explain it. I'll just show you in a minute. All right, so we're getting ready to do this Hydro Dip on the Pinewood Derby cars. And Benny is outside wishing he was inside, but we're going back outside. Um, See, so yeah, we're getting ready to do this Hydro Tip. We're getting ready to do this Hydro Dip on the Pinewood Derby cars. And right now, I am filling up this bucket with warm water. You're supposed to use warm water. And then we're gonna take it outside. Yeah, I'm getting the warm water now. I started on it. I'm not sure how much you wanna fill it up before it gets too heavy to carry. Uh, we're gonna find out. <laughs> Meanwhile, I got some chili over here simmering on the stove for when we're done. Do you think we'll need to do two of those buckets, or um, one may be enough? One might be enough. I know you need to get it de uh, deep enough that the water, that the car goes down like a, like totally submerged yeah. without touching anything. Maybe about uh, probably pretty deep. Yeah. All right. I don't know how heavy that's going to be. We'll find out. I'm gonna go check and see what the kids are up to. Right. Are they all outside now? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Let's go. See what if. Yeah, that's a good idea. All right. Let's see. Hey guys. You practicing your? Uh... Oh, you should put shoes on. For sure. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Hi. Dad is going to pour that water into the bucket. Ooh, it's steaming. Yeah, I think you might need some more. Maybe one more bucket. Yeah. So yeah. then we have this bucket of water. We're gonna, we're okay. Wanna explain what we're gonna do, Noah? Do you know? I don't want to hear. I don't know. I thought I knew like we're gonna spray. Yeah, we're gonna take all these different colors of spray paint and you spray them in the bucket, like in the water. And then we take the Pinewood Derby car and you dip it in and it's gonna make like a really cool, like almost like a tie dye, sort of like your shirt, but with lots of different colors. Like all of these colors. Yeah. If you to so do what colors are what Dad colors? I'm probably gonna use all the colors because he said oh, I'm, using, I'm making a rainbow card. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna this use. This. He's gonna be great.
Oh, here comes Dada with the second bucket. Let's Noah, will you close the door? Let's do yeah, it does say that on the bucket. Noah, can you close the door to the house? That looks very heavy. Yeah. I can't find the lake. I can't boiling water? No, it's not boiling. It's hot. That's plenty, yeah. That looks perfect. That looks way too much. Well, you want to be able to get the car down. See if you can see. The car can down all the way. No, the not right. No. All the way so that it's totally in the water. So, Dada made these really cool holder things for the cars, which I think he's gonna go get them now. Now we're gonna use that, so after the car gets put in the water, then you're gonna use one of those stir sticks. So one person's gonna hold it in, and then another person's gonna take the stir stick and move all the paint away from the car. Why? So that you can pull the car out. And also so we can make another- Do you have a place to set, we could, I guess we just set them on the driveway. Do we have like a little practice? Do we have a little example one? Yeah, Dada has a practice one right there. We have two practice ones. Okay, can I do one of the practice? Can, can I do oh, one? Oh, you, did you get, are those gloves or wipes? Gloves. Okay. That way your hands don't get paint on them. I want to do it. All right, Dada's going to do a test one. Didn't want to leave the. I want to do a screen. test one too. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. So, Dada, show us your invention that you made again. It's not an invention. It's a screw through <laughs> two paint stirrers. But then, after you take it out, you can turn this paint stirrers yeah, and make a stand. That's so cool. All right. So, Dada, what color? Why don't you do the test one and pick some colors? Okay. Dada's going to do a test one. And then, hey, Noah, why don't you get one of those um, stir sticks okay. and come stand over here? So you just spray the paint in the bucket. Back, stand back, and I get some on your clothes. Ooh, I want an apron. No one has a tin to open here. Yeah, we could probably good. leave the lids off while we're working with them. No, I don't want to confuse them. They will jump on there. The wind, you're going to get your clothes messy. Yeah, the wind is kind of making it a little bit. Do lots of layers, I think. We would do like. Yeah. Ooh. Ah, I like that spray paint smell. You like that smell? <laughs> you watch some videos about how to do this? Or are we just kind of... I saw a video. Noah has a stirrer so that you can... Okay. I have... Oh, I think you can like... Oh, oh, you're not supposed to do that. Alright, I see that. That's why this is a... You gotta... Yeah. Push it out to the sides and start okay. over. Alright. We'll try again. We're learning. This is our first time. Yeah. Um, I think as you put it in, it'll kind of like separate and move. Yeah. Add some more of the other color too. <laughs> Maybe a little more purple. All right, here we go. We're gonna try it. Okay, let's try to do it. All right, Noah, oops, you're supposed to pull the paint away before you take it out. Mm -hmm. So before, you're supposed to leave it in, and then when it's in there, mm -hmm. then you clear, somebody clears all the paint away so you can pull it out on a clean spot. Because see, it gets all lumpy on there. Mm -hmm. That's why we're practicing. Yeah. So now we just take this stir right, and push. You need to use more paint. Yeah, push everything to the side. All right, well, I have, a, I have a second test. Can I do it? Let Dad do the test again, so that way we have a good technique and we know what to do and what not to do. 
And how to so do then it we and how not to do it. Have everything cleared to the side like that. I'm gonna just stick that there. I'm, I'm gonna say. We got other. All right, let's try again. Do orange, red, and yellow. That's oh, careful, Abel. Do orange, red, and yellow to stand for fire. Is that fire? Yeah, that might look. That might. That might look cool. <laughs> Danny, hush, man. Yeah, hush, 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 hush. Hmm. Look at that one. You not get touched by the paint. Ooh, there's a lot of red left. Oh, Abel wants to use red, so. Yeah, and me, so you're gonna have to see. Let's do a different color. Oh, baby. Ooh. All the colors. That looks cool. Kind of spray them in different spots, like not all in the center. Maybe like over to the side. I'm doing all the rainbow colors. All the rainbow okay. colors. Doing hydro dips. Hydro dipping sounds fun. We are going to do hydro dip. This is hydro dip. It looks fun. Oh. <laughs> what? What? You almost got my shoes. I'm sorry. Working? Um, kinda. We're still. We almost got it down my shoes on accident. We have we have some test ones we're trying out. I can't wait. Can't wait. Now that's gonna look good. All right. Let Can maybe let it you? settle for a second, and see how like there's like all where the colors meet. Mm -hmm. Try putting it in there. But don't no no. I'm gonna wait. Like just dip it. All right yeah. now. We gotta get this stick and push it all the way to put it down. I gotta make a clear path so that way, now you can pull it out. Oh my, that looks so cool. That does look pretty cool. And the bottom. That's the top. Oh, that's the top? Oh, cool. Okay. Hey, can I see that one again, Joe? I didn't get a, I was trying to like clear the water. Let me see, what does that one look like? Hold it over in the sun a little bit so I can see it. Oh yeah, that looks really cool. I like that one. So let's see what did the other one look like. That one looked pretty cool too. There's a few spots on the top that it didn't get. I think we it, looks like, it looks like a flashy portal. I think that one needed maybe a little more paint. Yeah, it also looks like a flashy portal. Alright. I'm just gonna screw that in. Alright, well you wanna hold on to it? Be careful. Hydro dipping looks super fun. But don't try this. So which if, ones did you, you say, Abel? Know. He said he wanted red. Orange. This. Gray. Silver. silver and this color. Okay, that's it. Uh-huh. These are our test cars. They're looking pretty cool once they dry. Abel's, yeah, definitely needs more paint. Simon's yours looks very rainbow. Oh, and that one kind of looks like fire. Yeah, that is cool. I'm a monkey. That's good. You don't need to use all the paint. Uh-oh, <laughs> there went the lid. I mean, this, the nozzle.
Ooh, that's a off. Yeah, I think yours is done. You can take them off. <laughs> that looks really cool. When are you gonna? You're gonna have to add a lot of black, a lot more black. Let me guess. You're gonna call yours the green card. The black no. make gonna be called dirt. There you go. Straight down. Yeah. Oh, right there. Oh. I can't wait to see what Noah looks like. Noah looks like that. That's what his face looks like. <laughs> no, 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 Noah's car. Flip it over. All right, let's take a look. Oh, that looks so awesome. Oh, that's really this cool. This looks better than I thought it would. That's... I already have a name for it. Oh, what's the name? Well, I have two names. Lisa, who so, names the so car first, two names? It, it, the first name is military car. Uh-huh. Second name is the jelly car. The jelly car? Yeah. We're going to redo Abel's? Yeah. Yeah, baby. All right, let's take a look at Noah's. I wonder if we should have like put a base coat on them. Maybe. Maybe that would have helped. I don't know. I mean, they look cool. I think definitely more paint is better because Noah's has a lot of paint. So yesterday my battery died before I got to show you our final product of their Primo Derby cars with the Hydro Dip. A few things to note. We probably should have done like a base coat of like white or just like regular spray paint of their color of their choice. Um, but Simon's going to show us the cars, that they, what they look like now, because they've dried. And Joe applied a clear coat to them. So, that's okay. So let's take a look. Alright. Show us, which one's yours? This one is mine. That one's yours. That looks pretty cool. This one is Noah's. Noah's is the green one. And Abel, it kind of looks like fire. Yeah, his does kind of look like fire. Those are pretty cool. So then, after, I think Dada already applied all the paint stuff that we need to. So then we just have to put the weights in the bottom and the wheels on, and I think they're ready to go. Yeah. The, the race is on Saturday. Yeah, so that's how we hydro dipped their Pinewood Derby cars. Um, we definitely learned some things about the process. Definitely more paint is better. And probably apply a base coat of some sort. And um, be creative, I guess. I mean, they're going to turn out however they want to, which is the fun part, is that you don't know what it's going to look like when it, when it comes out, so. We may try to do it again sometime with some other items, but I think that was a really fun way to decorate their cars this year, so.